good morning. We're looking a little rough because I just finished a workout at Orange Theory. And a nice problem to have is that my studio is like 10 minutes from my job and the speed limit's like 40. So not like a highway that I'm driving on that with the windows open could get rid of some of the sweat. That's part of my look right now. So it's PD week still, or like it's only day two of PD, PD week, but I misread the schedule and thought we started at our regular contract time, which was 7.30. We don't start until 8.15. So that gives me some time to catch up on the things that I totally thought I was going to conquer yesterday and then laughed at when I realized there's only 24 hours in a day and you do need to eat and sleep. So I think what my plan of action is going to be is do a quick sweep around the room, see if anything needs to be laminated. Um, I don't know if anyone else is this way, but I hate wasting space in a lamination pouch. And so, for example, like our bathroom signs, um, I made them last year if you watched, but I'm not keeping signs that were in the bathroom all year. Gross. So like I'm remaking the bathroom signs and they're, I want to say like maybe five and a half inches wide. So that leaves about two or so inches on the side. And they're not 11 inches um, long either. They're probably, I don't know, nine or 10. So again, there's some space underneath. And so there's like eight signs. So I'm like, I have seven L shapes that if I can find something small enough, I can laminate. So I'm gonna go ahead in and hopefully laminate. And while the lamination's going through, start slamming stickers on notebooks. So wish me luck. Hello. All right, I'm assuming that you can hear me. <clears throat> um, I brought a charger today, so we're crushing it. Um, I'm gonna try to get just a lot of like logistical things done. So my uh, teammate just brought some like login cards. I'm gonna tape them to their computers and sign them into their computers while I do that to save some trouble from the first day of school or on the first day. I'm gonna, I printed a whole bunch of labels. Hold on. So these go in their Friday folders. And I think I, I don't know if I talked about this yet, but the forms I'm sending home, they have pencils on them and they have to come back to school, they have a pencil on them. If it has a crayon on the corner, it stays at home. And then that's only for my homeroom. And then all of my students in their classwork folders are gonna get incomplete and finished. And they'll know what to take home on Fridays. I was desperately waiting for some black ink to show up because these would not print despite that I had color and there's very little black like I would have changed that but it wouldn't print because of the little bit of black that there was um I have enough primary journals now so I'm gonna slap all the labels on I'm gonna finish the caddies today I'm putting the crayons in it's fine mm. oh and you can see over there the black trays I printed or I painted them and I cut out all the vinyl for them. So I'll also do like a video of me. What's the word I want here? Words are hard, but visuals are easy. Oh, I apply the vinyl to all the drawers and then it'll go on. I'm doing great. Nope, that big, <laughs> that big bookcase. So I'm gonna go get started, but I am psyched that it's just like easy things today. It's not up and down, up and down. And I might be ready to start printing some curriculum too, which is pretty cool. So that's where we're at. I'm gonna go get started.
the second, uh, it's the last top cabinet. The last top one. You're at, nope. The last top. top. See how they're split into twos? Nope, keep going all the way to the end, sir. All the way to the end, nope. I didn't think Ryan, step back. Look at how the cabinets are top and bottom. The, the doors. <laughs> so the last top one. <laughs> Keep going all the way. It's the very last cabinet. This way? Yeah. This, I can do that. Oh, I'm going yeah. left to right first to end. I know. Here first. <laughs> There's two in there. Take one or take both. Doesn't matter to me. <laughs> oh, look, the top. The top. <laughs> I'm looking at it on the last. Thank you. I was so deep in my head, I really needed a giggle. <laughs>
it is the end of day four. I think it's day four. We had half a day, oh, that's upside down. We had half a day in our classrooms today, but it was a really heavy morning. So we took a real lunch, which was super nice. And I think I took a picture of me eating my lunch or something to that effect. But um, after my actual real sit down lunch of not working, I did a lot of, like, I think I had said like, was it practical? I don't even remember what the word I used. It's now 5.30 <laughs> I'm still at school or I'm about, you know, leaving school. But I put so many stickers on folders, stuffed folders with things, names on notebooks. I tackled laptops today. I got their little uh, login cards, which I didn't take a picture of that because sensitive information. And I also didn't take a video of me doing that. I, I even felt like a little sketchy doing the folders. So that's why this content's a little bit shorter, just because there was a lot of name-based things. I just didn't want to get on camera, but I have a couple of blank things that I could share when I make a video tomorrow and just be like, hey, here's all the things that I did in this last video, you know? Um, but, oh, and it was very time consuming, but you did see it. I did get the new drawers done for differentiation and I am psyched with how they came out. Lesson learned that painter's tape, if you really stick it to a unprotected spray painted surface, which like, I imagine I probably want to put like maybe Mod Podge over the vinyl, especially if I see it start to peel within the next few weeks or even within the next few months. But I've, but I wasn't sure vinyl would stick to it if I had Mod Podged it first. But if you stick painter's tape down to it and there's no sealant over it, it will peel. But it's fine. It happened only on one of the drawers and I put a little scotch tape over it and we're going to let it be. It's fine. So I'm going to go drive home. Um, I don't know. I feel like I did a lot today, but also still somehow not enough. But at the same time, like if tomorrow was open house instead of Friday, other than not having Friday folders yet, just because the office hasn't delivered them, I think I'd be okay to go. I have one more quote to hang up actually, but uh, I think I'm done with decor. Oh, I'm missing a couple of signages actually, like uh, little wooden ones, like teaching is a work of heart or like our class is awesome or something like those are still in my cabinet so I probably should put those out tomorrow but otherwise like a really successful afternoon and tomorrow's going to be the same layout again so morning of professional development afternoons in our room and then Friday I think we have free until open house starts midday so I have one you know I can't do quotes because I have one hand but roughly one more day of time in my room before the first day of school so I'm gonna go drive home because traffic's gonna be awful but we're almost there it's like we're like in the home stretch which is kind of crazy so I'm gonna leave it at that thanks for watching days three and four bye